it's probably one of their goals where they don't need to have anyone tell them what to do or say this is how you have to do it. It's their expression, their emotions that come out on paper or whatever creative project they're doing. My name's Mary Machewska. I'm a community support worker. I've been here for nearly 20 years. Connectability Art Program has encouraged our participants to increase their fine motor skills by using paint brushes, pencils, to be able to express their, themselves more appropriately. Their outcomes have exceeded their own personal goals. They've been able to raise their level of concentration, their focus, their motor, motor skills, the expression on their faces when they've realised they've achieved their goals from when they first started is very rewarding. An important outcome is that the participants have a choice whether they can have one-on-one -on -one with their worker or they can e express their creative talents and ideas with other participants. The benefits of being part of a social group in craft and art is that they, they can exchange ideas one of the projects that brought all our participants together in our art group was the Newcastle project, which each artist had to find an iconic site together. They shared their ideas. They actually went out and took photos and they used those photos to be able to paint on canvas. As support workers, we look at every individual's goals and we assist them in, in achieving those goals. We want everybody in our arts and crafts program to feel included, no matter what their ability is. There is a project for everyone here. If you're interested in our arts and crafts program, you can ring us at Connectability. Everybody's welcome. We look forward to seeing you.